What is up, ladies and gentlemen? We're back here for yet another video, and uh, today I'm actually um, I came back to one of my fishing spots that I found on uh, in the Google Maps fishing video, um, which I know was like my last video, but I filmed it like a week and a half ago, so it's been a, a good while. Um, but today I've got two rods with me. I've got one rod. It's a seven foot medium. It's a crankbait rod. And then I brought my spinning rod out here and I just have a shaky head tied on. Um, as of right now, I've got a little, uh, square bill tied on my crankbait rod. Um, you guys, if you guys watched the video, you guys have seen this pond. Um, it's like a, a pond, like at a park and there's like, uh, a, a, like a lap around it or whatever. But um, other than that, it's pretty cool, um, so stay tuned. Um, last time I didn't catch anything here, but I think I was throwing the wrong uh, bait um, with the wrong line because it is a fairly clear uh, pond, so um, hopefully we'll be able to, uh, to get on some fish. But big news is you guys are actually watching me through a very brand new camera. Um, I just got this in um, like a couple of days ago. And uh, for a trip that I'm coming up on, I will be leaving in uh, like a week uh, or a week from yesterday, actually. So less than a week, actually. I'm super excited. Uh, the camera I'm using this right now is the Sony A5100. Um, there's no mic or anything right now. So I'm kind of excited to see the quality whenever I go back to edit it, see the quality um, visually and then the quality audio um, and just kind of see how it turns out but um, other than that hopefully you guys are liking the the quality so far I can there's there is a little screen up top for me that I can see but um, I do want to kind of you know just test out the quality I still have my old my older camera um, or the the other camera I was using before this um, this one is just a lot smaller um, and maybe a little bit easier to use in certain situations. But other than that, I'm going to head out, start walking to the pond, and uh, hopefully we can catch some fish. Alrighty, guys. Just got down here to the pond. And uh, this is the crankbait I'm going to be starting off with. So I got right here. Caught fish on it before. And uh, just give it a good toss out there and see if we can catch some fish. Oh, there we go. There we go, guys. First fish. First fish out here. There we go. A little old bass. A little old bass. Decent little guy. There we go on the uh, on the crankbait. Just kind of swiped at it. He uh, he hit it real close to the bank, actually, and. Uh, yeah, this is this is actually my first fish at this pond, so that's pretty sweet. Hadn't caught in a crankbait fish in a while, so nice to get on one of them. Decent, tiny little guy, right about eight inches maybe. No. Okay, guys, well, he was ready to get back in the water because I was just about to uh, to start filming to release him, and uh, he just kind of flipped off my finger. He flopped down here and hit the water and went in, so I guess I will put the camera back down, and uh, we're going to get back after it. But that is my first fish at this new little pond. Um, not a big guy at all. But uh, he hit it pretty good, so awesome fish. There we go, guys. Got another guy. Oh, oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, goshers. Okay. Well, there was a fish. He unfortunately came off but you guys saw him flopping on the ground fish number two hit the bank so it counts and uh yeah there we go 
little uh, quick release type of action, you know. Fish number two. This place is like starting to produce a little bit. Slowly, you know. Slowly. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yes. There we go, fellas. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Wow. These are the most finicky flopping fish. Alrighty, guys, got the uh, got our third little bass right here on uh, on the square bill. He hit it like super close to the bank, probably like two feet off the bank. But uh, other than that, we're gonna go ahead get him back in the pond. Alrighty, there we go again. Like I said, that was on the uh, the square bill crankbait. Um, still throwing that thing. Um, I did switch up to a tiny little swim bait on a swim bait jig head on my spinning rod But other than that still throwing the crankbait still got lots of confidence in it. It's caught me uh, Three fish now I've landed three fish. I had one fish on that was about the same size as that um, But he came off but uh, other than that I'm gonna get back in the water. Alrighty guys. Well, uh, I am gonna pack up and head Head back to my car. It has uh, it's been a good trip so far, um, but uh, I will see you guys back at my car for the outro. Alrighty, guys. Well, we are uh, we are back in the car, obviously now, and uh, we need to turn up that AC. But other than that, um, I hope you guys are enjoying this quality. Um, I'm also kind of excited, pretty excited to see the quality. I can see the the little screen that flips up but um, sometimes that isn't always a hundred percent true um, and you don't get all you don't always get the best visualization of what the camera is actually seeing but um, I'm, I'm excited for uh, for the, having this camera um, it's gonna be a lot easier to vlog with because that it's literally just the camera it's like can fit in my palm and the camera the other camera I have you got the camera, you got the mic, and it's, and then you got the little tripod deal, and it's the whole big setup. Um, so I'm gonna hopefully be using this uh, this camera a little bit more, um, especially for vlogging situations and that kind of thing, just because of its size. Um, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know I didn't catch a whole bunch of fish, um, which kind of stunk, but. Um, I still caught some fish. This is a pond that this is only my second time fishing it and the first time I fished it I didn't really have the right gear. Um, I think what was key today was having a fluorocarbon line. Um, last time I had braid it had no bites. The fish were very skittish. Um, today on my crankbait rod um, I caught I, I caught three fish. I had a fourth one on but he came off um, and uh, uh, I think the key for that for that crankbait was um, fishing it shallow because the fish were still pretty shallow um, and uh, fishing fluorocarbon because it doesn't the fish can't see it as good so um, other than that thank you guys for watching and I will catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation peace guys